if angle c is equals to 60 degrees then show that a by b plus c plus b by c plus a is equals to 1 and b by c square minus a square plus a by c square minus b square is equals to 0. So, we will prove the first one, first question first. So, that will be a by b plus c plus b by c plus a. Multiplying the <coughs> cross multiplying here that will be a into c plus a plus b into b plus c by b plus c into c plus a. Multiplying a inside the brackets that will be a c plus a square plus b b square plus b c. Again here b into c is b c and b into a will be a b. c into c is c square plus c into a is a square a c. Now, from cosine rule, we know that c square is equal to a square plus b square minus 2ab cos c. So, since angle c is given as 60 degrees, we will substitute 60 degrees here. So, 2 <coughs> c square is equal to a square plus b square minus 2ab cos 60 degrees. We know that the value of cos 60 degrees is equal to 1 by 2. So, we can cancel this 2 and 2. So, c square is equal to a square plus b square minus ab. Now, substituting the value of c square, which is a square plus b square minus ab in place of c square here. <coughs> Remaining all terms will be same ac plus a square plus a b square plus bc by bc plus ab. In place of c square, we are writing a square plus b square minus ab plus ac. Here we can cancel plus ab and minus ab. Now, the terms which are remained are a c plus a square plus b square plus b c and in denominator we have b c plus a square plus b square by plus a c. So, if we observe the numerator and denominator is same because we have all the terms same a c and a c a square b square and b c. So, we can cancel the numerator and denominator. So, the answer will be 1. Therefore, a by b plus c plus b by c plus a is equal to 1. Now, the second part of the question which is b by c square minus a square plus a by c square minus b square. From cosine rule, we know that c square is equal to a square plus b square minus a b. Actually, that is to c square plus c square is equal to a square plus b square minus 2 a b cos c. Since cos c is 60 degrees, we will cancel that 1 by 2 <coughs> as we have done in the first part. So, c square is equal to a square plus b square minus a b. Now, transposing this a square on the left hand side, c square minus a square is equal to b into b minus a. Taking b common in these two terms, we can write it as b into b minus a. So, in place of c square minus a square in the denominator of the first term, we can write b into b minus a. Now, <coughs> from the same equation here, if we transpose b square, that will be c square minus b square is equal to a square minus a b. If we take a common, that will be a into a minus b. Now, here we have c square minus b square in the denominator of the second term. We can substitute a into a minus b in place of that. So, that will be b by b into b minus a plus a, a by a into a minus b. b and b will get cancelled. Here, a and a will get cancelled. Now, we have 1 by b minus a plus 1 by a minus b. If we take minus common in b minus a, we can write it as minus 1 by a minus b plus 1 by a minus b. Since these two terms are same and have opposite sign, we can cancel them each other and the result will be 0. Therefore, b by c square minus a square plus a by c square minus b square is equals to 0.